the Dangerous Divas podcast and today I'm coming at you with a kick in the butt that you need because we're going to be talking about being unhealthy being your choice. It is your choice to be unhealthy whether you admit it or not. It will affect your life tremendously forever for the rest of your life. Every single every single second of your day you're either trying to improve your life or you're doing something to decline it. And I know this is not what you want to hear right now, but I'm coming at you with love, with care, because I care, because I love, because I want you guys to succeed. So I'm coming at you with a little bit of a tough love today. But let's look at the choices that we can make. There is a big difference, right? What you eat, how much you eat, when you eat, it, it's very different from me to you, from you to another person, things like that, right? What you listen to, what you read about, what you watch on TV, how much you move your body, how often, how many times a week, what you make your priority every single day, what is important to you, how consistently you want to work towards your goals, when do you see sleep, how much do you sleep, what kind of quality of sleep are you getting? How many times a week do you shower? How many times do you brush your teeth, you wash your hair, you stay clean? How you wake up or you snooze? The alarm, roll into bed, what time you wake up? How you go to sleep? Does that make sense? Things that we do differently and I want you to look at it because all of these are choices that you make every single day. And it's literally super simple. It's how you decide to live in your life shows the life, the outcome of your life, right? So how you decide to do certain things that are your choices, like brushing your teeth, it shows the outcome of your life. It's all a choice. It is your choice to be unhealthy. It is your choice to hit the snooze button. It is your choice to eat the bad food. It is your choice to stay up all night. It is your choice to be out of shape. It is your choice to starve in yourself. It is your choice to never have time. It is your choice to not showering. Now, I hope you do, but you know. It is your choice to listen to the bad news. Let me tell you this. I do not listen to the news. I don't even have TV at the house. Okay? I take three to four showers a day. I brush my teeth two to three times a day. I wake up at 6 a.m. every single day no matter how tired I am. I do my workouts no matter how tired I am. I make sure that my health is my number one priority, then my client's health is my number two priority, and my family. Does that make sense? Cool. So now let's look at the other side of the spectrum. Those are all choices as, as well. It is your choice to be in shape. It is your choice to eating good, healthy foods. Your choice to move in your body every single day. It is your choice to meal prep the entire week. It is your choice to eat in the calorie deficit for a fat loss. It is your choice to waking up early. Your choice to listening to motivational videos. It is your choice to showering every single day. It is your choice to drink water all day. Right? So does that make sense? I just said your choice in the bad way, your choice in the good way. They are the exact same thing. It's just how you do it in your life and how you do it and the choices that you make determines the outcome of your life. Because your health represents all the choices you make consistently every single day. It is your choice, so you don't like what you see, then work on it. If you don't like looking at yourself in the mirror, Instead of complaining about it and doing absolutely nothing about it, why don't you go and work on it and improve in the right direction? Change your mindset. Instead of spinning your wheels forever and getting stuck where you're at, 
It's also your choice. So I want you to look at the things that I talked about today and realize, are you doing it in a good way, in a good direction, in taking your life forward? Or are you doing it in a bad way, in the bad direction, and taking, taking your life in the direction that you don't want to go at? And if you are, change it up right away, change your mindset around that, and make sure that you're going in the right direction so that you can have the best success. And I'm not coming at you in a mean way today, I'm coming at you as a tough love because I freaking love every single one of you and I care so much about your goals that I want you guys to change that mindset because as soon as you do, as soon as you make this, this, these differences, you are going to succeed, you are going to see progress, you are going to go in the right direction. So my question to you is, what do you pick? Do you pick on being unhealthy or do you pick on in going into the health direction? You tell me. I know that I am in the right direction for my life. It takes a long time. It takes a lot of dedication. It takes a lot of patience. It takes a lot of consistency. But it is so freaking worth it. I promise you that. So my question to you is, what do you pick? Unhealthy or healthy? And I want you guys to come on my Instagram at Salome Abiger and let me know what you guys pick and how I can help you to change that mindset if you're in a negative mindset. Okay? That is it. That is all. Today was a little bit of a different episode, but I love every single, every single one of you. I appreciate you for watching, and I will talk to you guys in the next episode. Peace! Yeah.